Okay, well, I'll add your name. Sounds good. Okay. Heather, you're on the list. <laughs> Sounds good. <laughs> All right, we'll see. We'll see who's feeling lucky later on tonight. But uh, anyway, right now, beautiful evening in uh, the Sacramento Valley. The flag's just starting to pick up a little bit. And it's going to be another evening where we see the Delta breeze start to come in. It's 92 right now in Sacramento, a few degrees cooler than yesterday. And this weekend, we should be in similar territory. 94 right now in Stockton, some scattered high clouds. Winds are out of the west and northwest at about 10 miles per hour. Modesto, it's 93 degrees. Uh, the dew point sitting at 61. Dew points away, we track uh, the level of humidity. When those numbers get up into the 60s, yeah, you start to notice the humidity just a little bit. We do have some monsoonal moisture working into the area. It's 86 right now in Fairfield. The Delta breeze is already there. Winds are sustained from the southwest at 23 miles per hour. And look at this. It's 91 degrees in South Lake Tahoe. That is three days in a row with a high of at least 90 degrees up that way. Plenty more heat up in the Pacific Northwest, so no surprise that's kind of bubbled in to part of our area as well. Meanwhile, in the valley, you got again the onshore breeze kind of helping to keep things in check a little bit. Satellite and radar has been pretty quiet this afternoon. We did have a couple little showers bubble up north of Truckee. Those have pretty quickly fizzled out over the last hour or so. But as we go through the next couple of days, we are going to watch for the chance for some of these mountain showers and thunderstorms become a little bit more widespread. The wide view of the satellite and radar shows all of that monsoonal moisture across the four corners. And here's the setup that's going to help to pull some of that to the east. This area of high pressure sitting right overhead today, but as it moves to the east, we get a little bit more of an, into an east and then a southeasterly wind flow. So that's going to sort of up the moisture a little bit into the mountains and up the chance for some of those isolated showers and afternoon storms. Something worth paying attention to if you will be up in the Sierra this weekend. Again, especially during the second half of the day, things look a little quieter as we go through next week. But as for tomorrow, 87, the high in South Lake Tahoe, 89 in Truckee. Of course, we get a little downpour to come through uh, that would knock back the temperature just a little bit. Foothills should be staying dry tomorrow. Temperatures end up in the mid 90s. Very light west southwesterly breeze there. The breeze, of course, stronger through the Delta and into the Bay Area. 65 in San Francisco will be in the upper 80s to low 90s in the East Bay. San Joaquin Valley, we're looking at highs in the mid to upper 90s, so a degree or two lower than where we were today. And around Sacramento, we'll go for a high of about 95 degrees. We'll stay in similar territory Saturday into the day on Sunday. And it looks like we've got 90s through all next week. Back to you. Not too bad, Heather. Thank you.